morning, everyone. Um, a little bit of back background about my experience. I've served now on the Snow Isle Library Board of Trustees for approximately five years. Um, over those five years, I've been impressed with its mission, leadership, its employees, and the service that it provides to its clients. Over the period of five years, I've seen how the library system is critical in the development of our communities. I can tell you as president of the Board of Trustees that the future has never been so critically important to the Snow Isle Library System. Our public libraries are more than simply brick and mortar, uh, brick and mortar locations full of books. And they're more than simply a red box location that you can get books from as well. We serve as community doorways to reading, to information resources, and we provide opportunities for lifelong learning. Our 21 community libraries serve as centers for people to gather, to share and discuss ideas, to learn and appreciate culture, to search the past, to enjoy the present, and to explore the future. Our libraries help toddlers, preschoolers, teens, adults, retirees become literate and enjoy being lifelong learners. We help individuals find jobs, retrain themselves to be rehired, or advance in their careers. We assist entrepreneurs with information on how to start a business and to make their business even more successful. We provide opportunities for high knowledge pursuit and we support those who want to right society's wrongs by enabling high trust civic, civic dialogue with communities and the region through our Issues That Matter program. Through my work at the Library Association, through my work through the Bar Association, and probably in your lives as well, you can see today that there is a digital divide in our region. This divide is simply not between the haves and the have-nots. It's not just a geographical matter between the rural communities and the urban communities. In fact, the divide also includes those who can't, don't, or don't know how to go online and to access the universe of information available there. Our Snow Isle libraries, all 21, serve as bridges over that digital divide by working to enable digital literacy, digital fluency. So our clients, the communities, even your employees and the people that you work with can fully compete and be successful in the second decade of the 21st century. Quite frankly, I think libraries today are the best investments around. Even in the face of rapid changes, Snow Isle, today and in the future, intends to continue the work towards a strong, successful, and vibrant communities within our region, from Darrington to Coopville to Mount Lake and in between. And for today's conference, and when I talk about rapid changes, it's the perfect lead into our keynote speaker. Glenn Heemstraw is an internationally respected expert on future trends. He's founder and owner of Futurist.com. He's going to make you think about emerging ideas, trends, technologies. He's advised professional business governmental leaders for two, over two decades. He's cited in publications you may have heard of, The Wall Street Journal, USA Today, LA Times, The Economist. He routinely assists small businesses that you may have heard of that are around this area. REI, small place over across the water, Microsoft, and a small business we know as Boeing. So ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'd like to welcome um, to the stage our keynote speaker, Glenn Heemstraw. Glenn. 